When I'm worried and I can't sleep I count my blessings instead of sheep And I fall asleep counting my blessings When my bankroll is getting small I think of when I had none at all And I fall asleep Counting my blessings Hello, Trinity friends and family. It's me, Ryan, and Baker, here with another Quarantine Daily Video Devotional. Now, can any of you guess what that opening clip was from? You know it already. It's from the movie White Christmas. It's one of the best Christmas movies of all time, and that song, Count Your Blessings, is one of the best songs in the movie, and that's why I've got Baker with me, because he's one of my little blessings. Mwah. I'm going to set you down now so you can crawl around. But I was thinking about blessings the other day because Beckham wanted some water and so I went and I grabbed a cup and I immediately turned on the faucet and there was fresh clean cold water and I thought to myself how blessed and fortunate we are to be quarantined in a home that has fresh clean cold water immediately whenever we want it. You know right now during this quarantine I think a lot of us may have the tendency to be really negative or our attitude could very quickly go south if we let it. But we need to remember that we're very blessed people to be in a place where we have the amenities that we have. We could have been quarantined and go through this whole coronavirus mess in a third world country where we didn't have access to something as simple as water. In fact, there's a psalm that I would like to read to you that talks about how blessed we actually are, and it reminds us of who exactly the thanks needs to go to for those blessings. I'm going to read Psalm 103. Would you read along with me? Bless the Lord, O my soul, and all that is within me. Bless his holy name. Bless the Lord, O my soul, and do not forget all his benefits, who forgives all your iniquity, who heals all your diseases, who redeems your life from the pit, who crowns you with steadfast love and mercy, who satisfies you with good as long as you live so that your youth is renewed like the eagles. So right now, Instead of being negative or being grumpy because you're stuck indoors, thank the Lord instead. Bless God that you get to be quarantined in such a good life. The Lord may not heal every disease that you have, and the Lord may not protect you always from every illness that hits. It's very possible that any one of us could come down with the virus at any means, but we can rest assured that God is working for our good as long as we live, no matter what we go through, the Lord loves us and he cares for us and anything good that we have in life is due to him. And so today, if you're starting to really feel the hurt and you're starting to feel lonely and grumpy and miserable and negative during this quarantine, my advice would be to sit down and start making a list of all the things in life that you're blessed by. What are your blessings? Maybe today would be a good day to count them. I love you all and I'm excited about Sunday. It's Palm Sunday and we're doing something really neat for Palm Sunday. On Friday, Dan Cruz and I are going to drive around and we're going to hand out palm branches. We're just gonna put them on your front porch and we're gonna run away. But here's what we want you to do with them. Decorate your front door with them. Take a picture of it. Send us that picture somehow. You can post it on our Facebook page, email it to ryan at trinityorange.com, or just text it to me, 281-979-0196. We want to see how creative you can be with that palm branch, and 
We want these doors to be a testimony to the fact that Jesus is still King and we're celebrating Him and nothing can cancel Easter. And uh, so that's the purpose of it. Would you participate in it? Uh, I'm looking forward to seeing what y'all will do with it. I love you all and I'm praying for you. Call me if y'all need me. Thanks. Bye-bye.